I just finished getting ready for the day. Today is going to be a very long day for me. I have um, four classes that I go to in person and a class that I still have an assignment for that is online. I also have um, a couple of meetings tonight that I'll be able to take you guys along. Glad to take you on this day with me and let's get started. I don't think I mentioned that I am a English, um, secondary English education and Christian ministries major. So I have a good mix of education, English, and ministry classes. Um, but yeah, I don't know if you can see, but campus looks gorgeous. And <laughs> let's go ahead and go to class. Okay, so I just got done with my online class at Mocha's. I'm on my way to probably my favorite class of the day, which is my poetry class. Honestly, kudos to everybody who does vlogs on the regular, because this is kind of nerve-wracking. So, a lot that both of you found that could be really helpful if you're trying This evening is going to be pretty busy. Um, I am the president of the Hispanic Latino Student Association here on campus, or we just call it HLSA. And tonight we have a meeting because tomorrow we have our Dia de los Muertos um, celebration where um, we just come together as a unit and we celebrate the lives of people who we've lost. This is like a beautiful holiday that we celebrate where we can remember um, the people who we've lost and remember our, like the impact that they had on us and on others and what they did here on earth. Um, and we have the opportunity to celebrate that because mourning and grieving is hard, um, but we have this opportunity to just bring light and to bring joy um, in the midst of all of that. So, um, yeah, we have a meeting tonight about that. And then I'm also a discipleship coordinator for my floor. Um, and we have our life group tonight, which will be a lot of fun. We've been talking about healthy habits and how to love yourself using your love language. So that'll be really interesting and a lot of fun. So I am really excited to take y'all along. Okay, I just finished my last class for the day. Well, I had class again at 11, at 12, and then I had a meeting and lunch at one. So it is currently almost two. I have to change really quickly to head to my practicum at the seventh grade um, campus that I do my um, observations in. I am in my car on my way to the school that I do my practicum at. Um, I will be there until like 3.15. But yeah, so I figured I'd take this time to kind of just talk to y'all about what I do um, on campus as HLSA president, as a DC, because you'll see a little bit of that later. So starting with HLSA, like I said earlier, HLSA stands for the Hispanic Latino Student Association on campus. And we are an all-inclusive club. You don't have to be Hispanic or Latino to join. You don't know how. You don't need to know how to speak Spanish to join. It's a club that's literally just to appreciate Hispanic Latino culture, to educate others um, on what it means to be Hispanic, what it means to you know appreciate um, the Hispanic Latino culture, and um, to engage in conversation with others about it, and um, to eliminate the tension around conversation about. Um, ethnicities and the differences and how do we celebrate that how do we recognize and acknowledge those differences and and, and celebrate those differences um, as well um, HLSA is a cultural club so that means we are part of the CRC which is the cultural resource center located on the second floor of Decker um, and right
right outside the office you see like all of like all of the different flags from around the world um and yeah that the crc is an all-inclusive environment for um uh, people of like different ethnicities but also like if you're different in socioeconomic class like so sexual orientation like it's a safe environment for everyone and um I know the CRC strives to create community, to create bonds with um, just a diverse group of people. I recommend getting involved in the CRC, get involved in HLSA, there's also BSA which is the Black Student Association, there's also um, ISA which is our International Student Association. My favorite thing that HLSA does is that during Heritage Week we do a chocolate con pan which is we serve Mexican hot chocolate and like sweet like um, Hispanic style like sweet breads um, during Heritage Week and it's super cold outside and then you have this like nice warm like sweet bread and like hot chocolate with like some spices in it it's my favorite thing that we've um, done granted I've, I'm a sophomore so I've only been here a year but I love that and like I love doing games with everybody and never just having and seeing everybody have a great time okay I just left my practicum it went really really well I was actually able to do one-on-one -on -one work with a student which is um, just it's just nice to like get to know the student and how they work and all that good stuff so I am on my way back to campus now I am probably going to pick up a snack and a coffee because I am so tired. And after that, I'm going to go straight to the soccer game where I'm going to support some of our lacrosse girls and some of the girls that who are also on, they play lacrosse, but they're also on my floor. And um, yeah, so we're going to have a fun evening. So, update, I just got back from my practicum, got my coffee, but I'm going to get dressed now. I totally forgot that my team has wall ball practice today, so I'm going to get dressed, head to the KWC, and then I'm going to leave a little early so that way I can make it to the soccer game. So, I'm on my way to the KWC right now. I had another fit check, just, it's literally just athletic clothes because about to do wall ball with the team. Ooh, just gonna brave the cold for a couple of seconds and we'll be fine. In the KWC right now, just got my stick. We got new team sweatshirts. Let's go play some wall ball. And this is Morty. She's on a lacrosse team too. She plays defense. There you go, boo. <laughs> and this is Lex. Coach, say hi. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Hey, I'm here with Lily and Lauren, some of Anderson University's uh, women's soccer players who scored in today's game today, who also will be playing lacrosse for the first time in the spring, and who are part of my life group because they're on my floor. Yes. So we love these ladies. HLSA meeting. <laughs> Pizza night and talking about everything. Wrapped up our HLSA meeting. Some of our members left because we went over time, but we're just the overachievers over here. Yeah. And we have leftover pizza. So join HLSA! <laughs> join HLSA! <laughs> okay, so we are having life group right now. Um, it is a little bit after nine and I'm here with my girls. So we are going to go into our honors lounge. See, we have stations set up. Learning how to love each other and love ourselves in our love language. Hello. We have some nail stuff going on. Words of affirmation, writing on our truths, right? Woo! All right, I'll show you all around. 
So we are learning how to love each other, love ourselves through our love language. So in that room we had um, physical touch, words of affirmation, and acts of service. And in this room we have quality time and um, gifts. So see like the girls have prompts that they can write um, do some journaling or if they would like to write a letter to someone they have little pieces of paper and some markers and the beds are set up welcome to market martin second floor life group we have um a situation <laughs> welcome to the vlog guys <laughs> Thank you guys for following along with me on my day. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, definitely look into HLSA and joining any cultural club in the CRC. Um, we have the best time and it's awesome. So just dive into relationships with other people and just learn about different cultures and different, um, just a different everything and <laughs> just diving into diversity. So anyways, Good night, and as always, God bless and go Ravens! I'll see y'all.